Hello, you're looking at the 2014 Scion XB. This car I just purchased about two weeks ago, and I'm a normal driver. I wanted to make this review because I have to say, I love this vehicle. And um, I've read the reviews. I know what critics say, that it doesn't have the styling or the... Um, excitement maybe possibly compared to the Kia Soul or even the Nissan Cube but this engine is a 2.4 liter engine which is that of the Toyota Camrys and um, or the previous Camry model and I can tell you it handles beautifully absolutely fun to drive and I was coming from a 2002 Lexus RX 300 with all the bells and whistles. And it was, at first I thought, oh my gosh, this is an economy car. And I'm going from this luxury vehicle to this economy car. But what a great purchase. I just wanted to tell people because the shape did not thrill me at first. In fact, my husband said, this is $18,000 new. It's in our price range. What do you think? And I said, oh, it's hideous. <laughs> and then as I looked at it, got in it, and really it started to grow on me just like a song on the radio. Something that you hear and you hate it and then you can't stop singing it. One of those. So <laughs> I am singing the XP right now because, again, this, this is the base model. So we have hubcaps. They are not alloy wheels, although you can get that. Um, and really it comes standard with power everything. Um, we're going to look at the interior. Again, I had leather seating in the Lexus and now I have cloth seating. But it's really, it's nice. It's fine. Okay, so here's the interior of this XB with the nice two-tone with the little pattern there. And they're really known for their instrument panel in the center. So much room in this vehicle. So I'm going to get in, actually, so you can actually hear it as it starts and hear how solid it is. We're going to start the car up here. This vehicle comes standard with the touchscreen um, radio, HD radio, along with the Bluetooth. And you can see how the instrument panel lights right up. And I like it. You know, there was nothing here. And I thought, okay, it's going to be strange. But honestly, I can tell you, I really watch the speed now closer. <laughs> um, the shifter is just nice and simple. And look at that shelf there right before the uh, glove compartment. Tons of room, cup holders in the door. And there's your speaker up there. Oh, somehow I did the zoom. Let me zoom back out. Um, you can hear how quiet it is. Now, I'm going to actually shut the door. I wanted you to hear that thump because that sounded just like the Lexus did. It is a quality vehicle for an economy price. Okay, we're going to actually shut this down and look at the back seat because my husband, being six foot four, he needs the big tundra. <laughs> but he fits beautifully in this car. So we're going to see the back here. Look at that. So much room. I mean, this is so great for a family without having to be in the $30,000 range. You can have a reliable, safe vehicle with all the side curtain airbags, all the Toyota safety standards. And these are the 60-40 split, um, the seats in the back. And then you have the storage in the back, which we're gonna look at. I actually um, set up for craft fairs. I make jewelry and you can see what it looks like in the back. I love that the gate comes up really tall. And this has everything I need for my craft shows. And then again, when you fold down the seats, let's see if we can peer in so you can actually see the length of, this is a lot of car. <laughs> um, it rivals the space of an SUV. So when you fold down those seats, they said it's looking at 69.9 cubic feet. So 
the Kia Soul has, I think, in the 50s, maybe 53. Um, and this is the largest of the group. So the reviews were saying that it's lacking maybe the fun, innovative style. It got a little bit curvy and wide. But because of those changes, because this is the second generation Scion, because of those changes, you can have families fit in this car very, very comfortably. And again, for a normal driver like myself, I can tell you, this handles beautifully, fun to drive. And I will show you one more thing in the driver's seat. There is the, it's manual, but it's not a big deal. It's a lift to get the seat up. Really feels like you're in an SUV. Seven years of an SUV and I switched to this and it doesn't feel any different. How is that possible? Well, the Scion XB is a great choice for anyone. And I thank you for listening. Please consider this if you want an economical brand new car that will not break the bank at all. Thank you.